blood. Blood oozes from my broken fingertips. The toil to gain life's basic necessities makes me homesick for the past, a time when food was just a button press away. They call this lack of technology a simpler existence, but I do not believe them. After all, what could have been simpler than all my needs sated at the press of a button? Hey guys and welcome to the wasteland that is the world of post Finem, the mod pack made by Landstrider, where we have come from the past, where there was like, you know, all sorts of research pro resource problems and people fighting and like nuking the world and stuff like that, to the future, you know, after the nuking and stuff, so that we can like rebuild everything with the power of chemical decomposition and synthesis, you know, like moving around base elements to make the world how we want it. Uh, last time we'd managed to harvest some algae, we got ourselves some wood, some saplings and some dirt on the go, which sounds great. I think that's probably the first thing we want to go deal with actually. Let's um, run around up here. Uh, how do we get up here? There's a stairway. We're looking for looking for that spider. That's the first thing we're looking for. He is nowhere to be worried about, but that creeper up there, that's definitely going to be something to worry about. So we have a back door around here somewhere. I think it was down this way, but if we look over here, this, to me, looks like ideal growing conditions. So we'll pop them out and slam down some dark oak saplings. Hopefully, this will be ready relatively shortly. Uh, I'm going to pop this oak sapling down, and we should have some jungle. Okay, these should provide me with all sorts of wood. All sorts of wood. Uh, we have a skeleton to worry about over there, but I'd also like to get my algae back. Um, so, gonna have to do that somehow. Uh, let's just get in there and have a pop at him. Hopefully, ow! Hopefully without him shooting me, but he shot- Ah! Head crab! Head crab! Why are there head crabs everywhere? Hate these things. Um, I can't really hit him like that. There we go. That was all far too fast. Couldn't couldn't really deal with that. Uh, let us grab these out from under here, or not. Um, try and build up our algae stakes. Also, I'm fairly certain this guy had dropped some stuff down here. Okay, great. We are suffering from health, but I reckon if we eat some food, that should be all all right eventually. Uh, we seem to have picked up a helmet. Great, awesome. Oh look, it almost looks like the native helmet of my peoples. That blends quite nicely with my skin. Okay, awesome. Uh, what's next? I don't know, actually, to be fair. Let's uh, go inside and figure out what we're going to do next. So, if you remember last time, we were having, not troubles with food, but we're starting to get a little bit concerned about you know, the fact that we've only got two cooked cooked meat ingots left. So, along those lines, you'll see here we've got a, a quest for some fatty acids, indeed some triglycerol dry glycerides. Wow, I can speak today. They are a great source of energy for both plants and animals. Drinking the stuff is not very appetizing, but it will stay with you for some time. The chemical is also rich in carbon and hydrogen and may be refined into many other fuels. Which, you know, is, is the stuff we're after to help the world. So we want to de decompose some algae, some excess algae that we've got, and ch uh, turn it into some liquid energy. Now, the problem I'm noticing here is I appear to be sweating. Do you think that's something to do with this ridiculous number of torches I I put that hello one of those broke into a bit of stick crazy crazy all right let's let's rip a few of these up here um i'm not sure really what's the best sort of temperature to be aiming for if we take this one down as well that was quite a significant drop in the temperature but i think we can deal with it i think we can deal with it i'm a little bit sweaty still but it's good for me right so the quest asks for the this to be broken down. Um, I'm just going to have a look and make sure we got some room to put stuff in. Um, oh, we got some iron three oxide. Do we have any aluminium? We do. Do you reckon we can make thermite? That's what we need. I uh, iron powder and aluminium powder. Uh, I don't know. We'll, we'll test that out. But first, we're going to do these. Wow, stuffs. We got protein, chlorophyll, triglycerides. We've only got two triglycerides, but that's all right. Matt, one of the things we need to work on is definitely storage. But we've got our triglyceride. That's great. We get our eight back. Brilliant. And we get to claim one of these. Uh, iron? Or maybe some energy cells. How many energy cells do we have left? How many energy cells do we have left? Uh, two. Oh, geez. And we've got a food journal. Oh, no. When did the food journal come into this? Cook meat, cook meat, cook meat. Ooh, we're going to have to start thinking about other things to eat. Thankfully just made some triglycerides so that should be able to do us some food for a while uh iron iron is the one we're going to go for brilliant 
Well, we don't need to eat anything at the moment, but I'm going to put this on my hot bar in the same place that I would normally keep food. Uh, I appear to be suffering a little from sanity drop. If you look on the bottom right there. Uh, I'm not sure exactly why that is or what we can do about that. I'm sure at some point we'll figure it out. There are hot and cold zones all over this place. We're going to have to figure out how to make this place a little bit more uh, temperate, just all round temperate. Uh, okay, so after that, what's our next thing we're going to do? We're going to come down here towards the potato. This was the thing we were trying to do. So to do this, we need to make some crops. Okay, we need to make four crops. Craft some crops using four normal sticks and a crafting grid. Do we have... We do. Okay, there we go. A crop. Ah, we need four crops. Okay. Uh, we do another two from this and... Oh no, can only do another one from that. Another two from this though. And that should give us all four that we need. Brilliant. Spot on the money as well. Uh, we're going to go for the crops. Oh, I don't know. What do these things do? A hand rake or a gardening trowel? Let's come stand over here and open our any eye. Um, a rake. What, what does this do? Uh, used to remove weeds from crops. Okay, that's useful. That's useful. Probably more useful than the trowel. Um, if I can spell trail, there we go. Uh, used to move plants from one crop to another. Okay, I'm going to go with the very definite wooden hoe. Boom. Brilliant. And we got 24 crops, which means at some point we're going to be using them in combination with our dirt here to make some crops, hopefully. Uh, actual, like, food crops. It's a lot of... A lot of bad guys around me. We need to try and sort that out at some point. Um, okay. No, uh, look. The, the, what? Extra things of... I wanted the potato. I wanted the potato and you've just gone and done all this to me. What is it? All right. Let's start with amber waves. That sounds like wheat. Brilliant. Wheat was the most common grain cultivated for food before the end. Perhaps you should bring it back to the world. Yeah. No, I think maybe we should. Uh, use some cellulose to synthesize some wheat. So I think I've got some cellulose just kicking around. That's chlorophyll. That's not quite what I'm looking for. Um, iron oxides, proteins. No, let's have a look in here. We got any? We got cellulose here. Brilliant. Okay, so that was in here, right? Two wheat. There we go. Remember that from when we were trying to make the wood? It was two, 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 two. We put that in there. It was like, oh look, wheat. Brilliant. How many? How many bits are we after? Get the one. We get eight back. That gives us nine. That's three bits of bread. Um, do we want toast toast sandwiches are going to be like the most because like bread you then toast it to toast and then you add two bits of toast to make a toast sandwich oh, okay yeah i'm gonna go with a toast sandwich anyway i think we're about to get attacked by some oh no there's a crafting task there is a crafting task how dare they do this to me i also saw something out there so i'm gonna hide here look you see there's no line of sight to me that's ideal that's ideal so put the wheat you synthesize in the crafting grid to get crafting grid to get a seed oh brilliant awesome Good stuff. Uh, now are we done? Yeah, now we're done. Okay, toast sandwich. Claim reward. Uh, so we got some seeds. Am I going to turn the rest of this wheat into seeds? I think I'm going to. Oh, we got we got troubles. We got troubles. Where did you come from, mate? Ah, he's reload. No. Two, three. Go down. Go down. Oh, go down. Oh, and a head crab. Oh, wow. Took a beating, and now my oh look! Look at my sanity! Look at my sanity! We need to make a bed somehow. We need to make a bed. How do we make wool? Oh god! Oh, I'm panicking! I'm panicking! Oh, I'm eating slowly. Why? What's going on here? What different effect? We're, we're suffering from heat stroke. Seriously? One moment I'm too hot, and the next I'm too cold. Shh. Terrible. Okay, we're going to just kind of stand over here where it's nice and cold. Eat some more food if we can. No, not the, not the meat ingots. Wait, wait. We're not going to eat the meat ingots. For the main reason being is that we've, like, eaten so many in the pot. Wow! Look how much the toast sandwich does for me. I can't seem to eat it, though, because of this heat stroke. There we go. We good? I don't know if we're good or not. I don't know if we're good or not. Uh, so, is that everything I needed to make? It was, are, we, are we done on the wheat thing? Yeah, we're done on the wheat thing. Okay, good. At some point, we will go and uh, re regrow some wheat. Uh, carrots. Okay, carrots are said to be very good for your eyes. The chemical that is responsible for that, and that is called... Uh, that is a he And that is heavily present in carrots. It's called re uh, retinol. Wow. Speaking today. Speaking today. Synthesize some retinol and then use that to synthesize a carrot. Okay, well, how do we how do we get retinol then? Let's try and find out. Is that a real chemical? I've never heard of it before. I thought it was 
beta carotene. It's the stuff in carrots that people like. Oh wow. Oh wow. A hyd hydroxide iron. Well, I think we can figure out how to make that. Um, a whole load of carbon and a whole load of hydrogen. So let's go see if we've got any hydroxides in here. Uh, we have not. Okay, we could probably make some from water though. Uh, in fact, the water is in the wrong spot if we're going to be using it for that. Uh, I reckon the hydroxide is probably that and that. Yeah, look at that. Okay, we'll make one of those. Um, what have we got here that we don't really need to have on us at the moment? Like, we can put the iron in here, the aluminium. We need to make some storage. Serious some storage. This is what I've been saying for a little time now. Gotta make it happen. Gotta make it happen. Um, I think my my stuff keeps rearranging itself on me. Um, oh well, that, that's fine. Uh, we've got some cobble left over. Just doing a little bit of a search here. Um, okay, so we made that. Let's let's do this. Okay, so we got everything laid down for it, but we are short of carbon. And when I say short of carbon, we are proper short of carbon. These triglycerides seem like a good place to get some from. So let's have a look. We'll pop it in here. Um, Protein is also a good place to get some carbon from, by the looks of it. Take out some nickel and some pyrite, and then if we just kind of pump the protein back in... Yeah, what could go wrong here? What could go wrong here? Two, three, four, five. Last one. Brilliant. Uh, we are now just full of stuff. No, I don't, I don't want anything to do with you, Mr. Gast. Why would you even say that? One, two, three. Oh, look, we got a thing there. What's this? Christine... I think that was how you pronounce that. Uh, how are we doing now? Uh, C20 is still not quite enough, is it? It's still not quite enough. No, it's exactly enough. There we go. Boom. Made one. Need. Oh, still need storage. Now we need to use that to synthesize a carrot. Now, by any. Oh, am I still getting heat stroke from that? Let's turn, take that off. Let's take that off. Uh, I think I need some liquids. Look, look down at my, my bar there. It's not doing too well. Oh, look, we've got some uh, rotten flesh we can pick up as well. Not overly impressed with the noise of the ghast. Where is it? No, I think we should be all right. Run down and fill up. Oh, no. The last thing we want is a, uh, a zombie coming for us. At some point, we're going to have to make the trek across there and test, see what those villagers are like. If they're always going to be angry at me. Oh, I mean, I presume there's villagers out there. I don't, I don't know actually what's going to happen. Look, there's the witch that I was worried about. Terrible. Okay, um, can we just, like, get in the water and chill out? Is that something that can happen? Like, deep water, yeah. I know, it looks like it should should take my uh, take my temperature down. I don't know, though. I don't know. Uh, it seemed to be doing all right. Let's head back inside and um, work on making this bed or something. Uh, no, the carrot. We're, we, we are working on making the carrot, I remember. Okay, the carrot is about as simple as you can think about how to make it. You take the uh, this stuff. Ah, oh, I put it in the decomposer, not the not the synthesis. That's all right though. Thankfully, we can just like pop these back in here. Take this out. Brilliant. And then just pop that there. No, let's clear all those out. Pop that there. And then we got ourselves a carrot. Brilliant. And then we craft it into carrot seeds. And if we're lucky, we can get out there and plant all this stuff before night comes around. Uh, was that everything? Cool. I'm going to take some glazed carrots. Seems like the best. No? Yeah. There we go. Glazed carrots. We've got some carrots as well. Going to craft those into seeds. Uh, we have a couple of 9 by 9s we need to put down. That is not going to be enough. We do not have enough dirt. So one of the things we're going to have to do when we get out there is figure out one where our farm is going to be. I mean, I'd kind of like to farm inside, but at the same time, I don't know, out here, we're, we're trying to make a new world. Why, why would we not not try and make it outside? Five, six. Okay, now I believe we need to... Uh, where's the top of the jungle tree? Why? Where's all the leaves? What? What's this about? How dare you? Why would you steal all the stuff from me? I mean, I'm pretty sure we can resynthesize it from the logs. But, wow. Am I still suffering from heat stroke? Seriously. How do we get rid of the... How do we get rid of it, then, now that we've got caught heat stroke? What am I supposed to do? I'm just kind of chilling out down at the bottom of the water. Is there anything else I need to do? I don't know. Can I drink the surface water? I can't drink the surface water. I've got to be above the water to drink it. Terrible. Uh, once again, I'm just kind of chilling out down here to try and get rid of my heat stroke. Okay, so I'm down all the way until my, my 
breathing near the end, and no, doesn't seem to do me any good. Still suffering. Oh no, it's done. It's fine. It's gone. Brilliant. Okay, well, there's something that we're going to do from now on. I don't know whether that's going to just be a superstition that doesn't actually have anything to do with what we're actually trying to save us. But, you know, when we when we got heat stroke, we're going to throw ourselves in the pond. We're going to throw ourselves in the pond. Okay, next task on uh, is blatantly to try and get these things grown. We've got some iron, we've got some sticks, so to me this screams that we can make ourselves a hoe. I hope everything is normal. Um, need to make some chests and stuff as well. Uh, keep saying this all episode. Guarantee that we're not going to be able to get round to it until next episode just because I keep saying we should do this. Uh, so, let's make a hoe first. Not that one, this one. Brilliant. And then I've got some iron. Iron hoe, why not? I mean, wood hoe would probably do, but we've got the iron to spare. I know lots of you are going to be screaming at me, like you're only going to use it six times, well, like 12 times, something like that. Why would you do that? But, you know, stuff you. That's all I've got to say That. All right, up here, we are not going to be able to get our crops irrigated up here, are we? Um, I don't know, we'll have to figure that out. We'll have to figure that out. Still says hot. Still says I'm hot. We'll have to figure that out. Uh, in here, if we take this bit of water, this bit of dirt out we should be able to create a small farm of some description i'm hoping should be able to look, look we'll put that one there that one there we're missing one but that's good enough for me that's good enough for me did we make a bucket we did not make a bucket. yes we did we got given a bucket i remember i remember uh so let's oh well thankfully there's no broken legs in this game let's go up here and check this out hopefully getting all the water down will be enough to Get us going. Right, we need some crops. Now, if I remember correctly, Agricraft works very, very awkwardly. Um, so if we do this, yeah, we'll, we'll double cross a lot of these. But I'm going to just grow a seed on. Oh, no, keep my. Got to keep my weapon in my hand. Just going to grow the seed there. That, that's, that's how we're going to do. Let's go get some more water. And biggity bam, nowhere near completely done, but we will definitely get on it at some point. Uh, there's some carrots. Right, I will work on these at some other point. I definitely have to make some uh, make, make some saplings as well. All these things need to be done. Ah, look, it carried on growing. It carried on growing. What? I think something freaky is going on here. I think there's a, uh, a sinking issue. Oh, well, we'll figure that out when we come back to uh, chop it all down with an axe. Okay, so now that we've done uh, some planting and stuff like that, I think it's time to do the Farmer's Almanac. It's important to keep good re records of each crop generation so you can p pick only the best seeds to grow the next generation. A seed analyzer can help you with this task. Okay, uh, a task where a player has to craft this specific item. So let's figure out how to make it, the seed analyzer, hey? Uh, in here, hopefully it should be... Nice and simple. I mean, how could anything be awkward? Glass. We're going to have to go looking for sand. Sand is a must. Um, a slab of some description, like a stone slab of some description. Uh, we got some woods and some sticks. Okay. All of these things well within my capabilities.
right, guys. So my plan with all that sort of resource gathering that we just watched was to make the seed analyzer in here. But I have just noticed something that's that's much, much more important. Over here, we have a microphone, uh, microphone, microscope. Uh, and in there is the chemist journal, which allows me to store all the... the uh, recipes and stuff for the chemical synthesizer. This is the thing that I have been after since episode 2, so that is what I'm actually going to be working on, but unfortunately I have completely run out of time, so I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. I will see you next time where we're going to go find some sand, maybe make some sand, I don't know, we're going to do one or the other, uh, and make this chemist journal and the seed analyzer, and get on track with being able to record stuff and do things properly. So anyway... I will see you then when I'm going to do that. Bye!